Ever wondered what really happens when two electric cars collide? Well, at the Mercedes-Benz crash test facility, they put it to the test. And let me tell you, it's not pretty. At this facility, they perform up to five crashes a day, and the aftermath is anything but clean. After a collision at a closing speed of 70 miles per hour with a 50% offset, the ground is littered with thousands of pieces of debris. Tires are torn off, suspension systems are ripped apart, and headlamp units are flung into the far corners of the site. It's a scene of destruction. But here's the surprising part. Despite the chaos, the passenger compartments of both cars remain undamaged. The doors open, and the battery cells are unbreached. The crumple zones, designed to absorb and dissipate the impact, are still hot to the touch. It's a testament to the engineering and safety measures put in place by Mercedes-Benz. You see, Mercedes-Benz has a vision of zero major injuries or deaths in their cars by 2050. And they're taking that goal seriously. In a battery electric car, there are unique challenges when it comes to crash safety. On the plus side, there's no engine block in the front, allowing for enhanced rollover protection and larger crumple zones. But there's also the heavy and vulnerable battery pack to consider. To protect the battery pack, Mercedes-Benz has designed a massive high-strength steel frame with crumple zones. In the event of an impact, the high-voltage cables are automatically isolated, ensuring the electrics are disconnected. They're taking every precaution to prevent any potential fires or high-temperature incidents. And it's not just the safety of the occupants that Mercedes-Benz is focused on. They're also working on mitigating the risks to vulnerable road users, like pedestrians, cyclists, and motorcyclists. With pyrotechnic, soft-deforming bonnets, autonomous braking, and advanced radar and camera systems, they're aiming to reduce the impact of collisions. Now, it's important to note that outside of a controlled crash safety laboratory, there are many unpredictable factors on the road. Road furniture, other vehicles, and unsecured items in the cabin can all pose risks. And even with the safest cars, there's always the potential for human error. So, while electric cars are making strides in safety, it's crucial for all drivers to prioritize safe driving practices. Let's remember to drive responsibly and be aware of our surroundings. Because no matter how safe our cars are, it's our actions behind the wheel that truly make a difference. Do you own an electric car? How do you feel about its safety features? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, drive safe out there.